Here's that breaking news. An hours long standoff is over in South Nashville. Police say Michael Tucker, wanted for murdering three people in Memphis, has been found dead inside a hotel room. Police just wrapped up a press conference about this less than 30 minutes ago. News 4's Tosin Fikile is in South Nashville right now. So Tosin, get us up to speed here. What else did police say? Yeah, police say they believe that Michael Tucker, who they've been trying to reach in that room at the La Quinta, died from a self-inflicted wound. And it's been an active scene here since about 10 o'clock this morning. Fewer police presence here on this street on Sitco Drive. Police say MMPD SWAT team and negotiators tried negotiating with Tucker, who fired three shots at U.S. Marshals through the door to a room at that motel this morning as they were trying to bring him into custody. Tucker was tracked down to this hotel as he was wanted on three counts of first-degree murder, two counts of attempted murder in Memphis for a shooting on March 26 involving five people. After several hours of hearing nothing from Tucker in the room during negotiations, at 3 p.m., police say the window to the motel room he was in was breached and tear gas was put inside the room to get a response. The tear gas was allowed to stay in the room for several minutes and there was still no response from anyone. And here's what police say happened next. The door to the motel room was breached and a drone was put inside the room. As the drone uh, entered, it uh, revealed the presence of a body inside on the floor of the motel room, uh, presumed to be Michael Tucker. Don Aaron there with MMPD also said there was a gun found beside the body in that room. The next step right now is the homicide unit is going to investigate what happened here. Tracy, and I also want to mention to you that earlier they had uh, the ramp to 65 North here closed off. That is right now back open.